Hello, so this is my second video. So you haven't if you haven't checked out my first video, you will be confused to watch this video. So please watch the first video and come back to this video. And so um I was just talking about um duplication of names. Um if if there are uh four names that are identical, these four names are identical actually. So if you can actually just select it and delete and um delete it it's black on black so you can't actually see um what is going on but now i have actually got a uh, one unique name here um then uh i have got the information lifted onto the week for four weeks you see so if um the names is um if this column of all the names is identical to this column, I'm able to pull this information onto the four weeks. Previously, I called this com comment one because I don't know what to put on here, but I thought let's put training on. So if there is an exact match with the name, I'm able to pull up um, the, all the training. And then you can actually see the rotor, which is very nice indeed, I think. And A, um, it could be that um, here there's a red corner. Um, they might have used a nickname or sometime um, they use the first name and not the second name. Yeah, like that. And so um, I was, I have been shared with another spreadsheet called the conversation of the redeployment same thing i have imported this from that spreadsheet and then i try to uh, match well i have created a formula uh, to pick up the names from here and um, any red corner means that you just need to retype it and try and find a match so um I have actually done the counter as well to see how many frequency of people have uh, entered twice, entered three times. And then um, I found that 54 people have entered twice and three people have um, entered three times. Not that is important, but I like statistics like that. And so, um, this is actually in the second column. Yes, meaning that they have had conversation, but then um, if it's uh, three dashes, one, two, three, like that, um, it could mean that the name um, is not, it has got a red corner. So again, just uh, retype the name and to see if there is alternative name for the same person so if that is done um this week four spreadsheet will be updated with the data from the head office and so um remember you you can actually just go ahead and delete people who does not belong to this group you know it's actually not a big deal if you want to in insert more people you just um insert the line and then just copy and paste delete uh, these two people's name and then retype in um their name yeah and all these uh formulas will actually pick up uh the names and they will deposit the data on here yeah and uh once you got your names all set up here um the other tab called the import tab will uh pick up your name and um deliver the information so week four is actually quite an important tab yes i'm running out of time now um thank you for listening i hope i was clear Thank you very much. Goodbye.